All right, today we're going to show you how to set your programmable fuel gauge on your multifunction Phoenix platform gauges. This holds this multifunction means there is multiple gauges controlled by one unit, quad gauge, three and one, whatever. So it's uh, all of our fuel gauges feature uh, electronic dampening and they have user selectable inputs. So they work on virtually any sender. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to see what we have. So I'm just going to pull back here. There's a plastic cover that covers the dip switches. We're going to, I just pulled the cover off. I see that it's on, off, off, off. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a look in my book here. Okay, on, off, off, off here shows this is a universal setup. That's how we ship all of our gauges. Uh, that way they're all the same setting, on, off, 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 240 to 33. So let's say, for example, I have a uh, Camaro, uh, late 60s Camaro. So that tells us GM 6589, second row down. Uh, this is on page 9, 0 to 90, off, on, off, off. So all I'm going to do is set it to off, on, off, off. So I'm just going to take my gauge here. So you can see the dip switches are labeled one, two, three, four, on, off, off, off. So we need it to be set to off, on, off, off. So I'm just going to take something here like this, turn this one to off, on, off, off. And then I'm going to replace the cap and this is ready to go. If you don't know what you have, give us a call. We do have a, a pretty easy technique for finding out what you have and uh, we'll get you all set up this way you don't have to buy any additional senders or anything like that and makes the installation go a lot faster for you